Hello everyone, Kilogin here. Today I will show you how to install the Parrot OS hack the box version. Ok, let's go it. First of all, we need to go to the Google, write Parrot OS. We go to the first site, parrotsec.org. Let's go Parrot OS. We have the first page and we click on download. Here in the left side we have 6th version of the Parrot OS. We have the security edition, we have the home edition, we have the new release hack the box edition, we have cloud edition, we have architect edition and the raspberry pi edition. But today our scope is to install the Parrot OS Hack the Box Edition. In the right side we have three buttons. We have download, we have torrent to download and compare hash we don't need this. First of all let's click on download. We need to download the ISO file. We wait to download it but I have the version download right now. I will close it. Then we need to have installed the VirtualBox machine. You know, I will show you again. Let's go to the Google. VM. And we have Oracle VM VirtualBox. Here we need to go. Install it. Download the VirtualBox. And after install the VirtualBox, we need to have the application like this. OK. First of all, we need to click on new button. We put the name of the parrot, parrot, hack the box. We need to choose the machine folder. You can make a folder. I make it here, virtual boxes. Okay. We need to choose the type of the virtual box machine we got the linux and we choose the debian 64 for parrot hack the box we click on next now we need to choose the memory size then i will choose uh, 6 gigabytes i think it's enough let's go to the create a virtual disk now go virtual box disk disk image next Dynamic allocated. Okay, now we choose, I don't know, 14 gigabytes, it's enough. Let's go create. After we create this, we see here storage. We have an optical drive here. Click on it, choose, and then go add and go to the folder where you download the Parrot ISO file. Go choose. And you have the Parrot ISO file here in the ID secondary device. You can choose more memory, but for now it's enough 16 megabytes. And then go start. Okay, let's wait to boot the virtual machine. Okay. Click on the okay and then enter. We wait to boot the virtual machine but I will let like this ok you need to wait a little bit to boot the Parrot OS ok ok this is a little trick if you have the size like this on the virtual box you can click this and make the biggest okay first of all we have on the left side five things and we need install parrot just double click on it welcome to the calamers installer okay let's go next let's find the region i am europe and Bucharest 
let's go next keyboard its default version we choose erase disk because we are on virtual box machine and we don't need another things we go next and what is your name i put my name and here i put the password you can put what password you want and then i go install and install now okay let's take a while to install and i will come back when the install is 100 percent okay the installation is done we need to restart let's press done okay after installation we need to exit go to the storage click on the controller id remove the disk and then start again because the machine is installed we used just the ISO file for install the parrot OS. now we wait the booting okay this is the first boot for Parrot OS. Hack the box version. Okay. Let's type the password. Enter. And automatically make the biggest image. I can go full screen mode. Okay. Go to the terminal. <clears throat> this is the Hack the box version. If I go change ba background, let's wait a little bit to see what backgrounds they have. Yeah, let's choose this hack the box and testing that. Okay, and first of all, after you install a virtual machine, type sudo apt update just enter you put the password enter and they show us we have 114 packages can be upgraded and then let's go sudo apt pull dash upgrade enter after press y and then enter and you update the machine after machine is updated you have the parrot os hack the box version and you can go to penetration testing web application testing you can do all you want you can hack what you want just go to the hack the box site and make all the labs go ctfs all you want thank you for watching me have a nice day and we will see you to the next video thumbs up